ladies and gentlemen, now it is time for the first ever live Q&A. We are now going to be accepting questions during this video. They will be coming into us live, and we're going to get on the phone with Dylan right now. See if we can get through. Alright. What's happening, Dylan? Not much, man. How about you? Not a whole lot, man. Been anticipating this uh, first ever live Q&A and say we've got some questions waiting for us. Alright. Alright. Who goes first? I'm going to pick somebody. Just a second. Alright. I'm going to go straight to uh, kick and we've got somebody waiting with a question. I have a question. Alrighty. It's from Colby. He said, what would you do if I woke up with one, like, one testicle? Alright. I'd scream my ass off. Like, ah, I lost my balls! Really? I, I'm not really late. Okay, not sure what happened there. We went out. Come on, Dylan. Ah. What the world happened? I don't know. You hung up on me. I don't know. Must be my connection. Okay, so back to where we were. About after what? your balls, we got a question coming from a fan. Her name is Sister Divas. And her first question is What are your favorite shoes? And what makes you happy? Can you give us a take on that, Dylan? You should be nicer to what? She says, what are your favorite shoes? This Wi-Fi is fucking up. <laughs> uh, somebody asked, what are your favorite shoes? My favorite shoes? Yeah. Uh, hmm. we'll have I am a huge shoe person, so probably... Um, I have to say Nike. The Jordan Retros or the... KD7s, KD6s, probably the phone, the red phone posits. I've seen, I've seen Nike Air. I'm a huge, I'm, I have shoe game. I, my shoes are fresh. All right. Next question was, what makes you happy? My girlfriend Megan. She makes me happy every time I see her beautiful smile. All righty. Isn't that nice? Uh, basically, when it's when I'm not having a bad day, or when I have accomplished something that I've tried to do for a long time, something that I've been working at and hasn't been working so well. Okay. All right, guys, go ahead and send in some more questions if you like. Wow. Dylan, what in the world is going on, man? I'm trying to make food. For real? And I need to get a pot in the bell. Wow. Alright, I'm, I'm uh. Mashed potatoes. You don't got any more questions? Uh, I got a couple of questions. Alrighty. Alright. This. Alright, this. A kick. Name Savage Randy twenty seven asked, "What would you do if Seth Rollins retained the championship at Battleground?" Once he retains it, right? Sure. What would you do? Uh, to be honest, I want Rollins to win, so I guess I'd win twenty bucks. I I put a twenty dollars bet on him. <laughs> I'd be fucking happy. I legitimately put a twenty dollars bet. 
on that boy. So if he wins, I'm coming after you, Harley. Wait, what? All right, I'll tell you what. Once, once Seth Rollins wins, I'm gonna go all over social media. I'm gonna tell every Brock Lesnar, fan, every every person who's ever said Suplex City. That's that's how far I'm gonna go. Every person that said Suplex City. This is the same man that broke Triple H's arm. This is the same man oh, that John took Cena, Cena all, Cena all Cena over the Cena building. Cena. This is the same man that ended the Undertaker's streak. The only thing that dignified Undertaker as a professional wrestler. This man has done so much damage and harm to the company. And all you guys, oh yeah, I like Suplex City. Oh yeah, Suplex City, Suplex, Suplex City. Let me tell you something. This man is going to get his Sunday. Alright, next question. I think it's... Um, Jelly 20, 20 something, I don't know. I don't even know the name. I know it's Jelly something. She asked me, uh, let me check the question real quick. Alright, she asked me, if you woke up one day, not knowing what day it was, and you can't see, and you can't find anybody, what would you, what would you do first? Like, if there was nobody around you, like there was nobody left on earth. I will keep sitting there in awe. <laughs> <laughs> I I would probably go to the mall, steal all the shit I want, watch <laughs> any move I want. I I just go straight out. Like I'd go to the liquor store and all of that. Alright. Alright, you guys can send me your questions. I'm going to set this down and I'm going to get some more questions for you guys. Alright, I've got a question from Jessica334. She says, what would you do? What would you do if you woke up with three women next to you on the bed? Wait, what did you say, Harley? Jessica335, I believe it was. She said, what would you do if you woke up with three women next to you on the bed? And it wasn't even your bed. <laughs> uh, uh, <laughs> I, I fucked up. <laughs> I don't care what he look like. I just fucked up. They pump things all over their bed. And, t and walk up to that girl's dad and said, I just fucked your daughter, bitch. <laughs> Let me tell you something. Uh oh. You need to watch your mouth, son. Watch my mouth? This is my video. My channel. You're gonna keep this PG rated. <laughs> you are gonna. I'm bringing Attitude Era back. I'm sorry? I'm bringing Attitude Era back. You know what? How about you shut your mouth, Dylan? You understand that? You can see now, man. Loud and clear. Shut your freaking mouth. No, your role is shut your mouth, you little pussy. Stick. I don't want to hear nothing. This is my channel. This is an outrage. You are not going to embarrass me on my Q&A session with you. Mine. 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 Now, I'm going to be saying that when I beat you for your title. Mine, you know what? Mine. This mine. Thursday night in our three At stages UWA of hell. Debuting. I'm gonna beat Harley in the three stages of hell match. It's gonna be a clean 2-0 sweep, no matter what match it is. And everybody that watches this, vote for tables match. I have never lost in a tables match. Vote for it. Okay, and they can vote for ladders too, because I've never lost in a ladders match. I will win this match. Is that what you really think? You really think you're gonna just walk onto this scene and just take a victory and take my championships that I've worked months to get? Is that what you think? Suplex City, bitch. <laughs> I've had it with you. And I'm gonna show... I'm gonna show the world and nobody, nobody can do it like me. Just ask your mother. <laughs> yo, yo. Woo! Woo! I fucked up. Alright, 
right, I got a question from James Five. James the man. Oh my God, the man James underscore fifty five. Okay, he says he says Thursday night I vote tables, ladders, and chairs. Hey James, idiot! Anybody there? Anybody there, James? It's three stages of hell match. It's not just gonna be one match, you freaking idiot. You freaking incoherent, babbling, stupid, suffering, son of a sellout, suck up, suck a test, son. And after that match, I, oh, yeah, I know, that was not easy to say. After that match, I will walk out champion. Because I am the hardcore icon, and you are a bitch. And with a major itch. You should and bury you in ditches. Because I hang with the money. I hang with the riches. You so what shit. song are you going to be saying if you come out victorious Thursday night? I'm going to win, yo. Ain't no doubt. Once Ain't I no win, doubt. I'm going to raise my yo. hand. Proud. I'm waiting for this, yo. And I'm, I'm going to say, you have no idea. I am the champion. I'm going to take that title away from you, yo. You know what? I think, I think we need a trash talk session. Something what? like Wednesday or Tuesday next week. We need a talk session, like a promo? A trash talk session. Like oh, a, man, like a, like that. sort of like the contract sign. You know, what last few words before the match. Man, I'm going to crush your ass. I'm going to take that title away from you. Shut bro. your mouth. Stop Shut it. Stop it. Right now. This is Stop my it. house. This, game, this is my house. And you your can't live in it. Garbage, you boy. can't live in it. Thank you a, and goodbye. I'm in a nice house, actually. It's just a little dirty. Now, what were you saying? There are one of two things happening this coming Thursday night <laughs> on the show. One, you walk out with the title. Oh, that's but you don't walk out. What if I walk out, champion? Two, what? I take the title and I run all over you and then I hey, leave. I'll be fair. I'll be fair. When I beat your ass, I'll give your ass a rematch. I'll be fair. You're not going to take my championship so we don't have to worry about that. Isn't that right? I'm going to take that title from you, boy. It ain't no doubt. I'm just going to go in there, whip your ass, and take it. Alright. You know what? You I think this show. deserves... Some, a little bit of fan involvement. I'm a so starting a tonight, we are setting up a poll on Kick. Anywhere you guys see this video at, I want you to comment underneath it. Tell us who you think is going to win. Yo, Dylan, no, it's going to be either shit. hashtag Dylan for yes. champion or hashtag Harley retains. That Harley is again hashtag Dylan the champ. I'm a four percent. Or hashtag Dylan for champ. Hashtag Dylan for champ or hashtag Harley retains. You guys Dylan get to for decide. champ, yo. You guys vote underneath in the comment section. Message me on Twitter. And it looks like we're getting a message in. Says hashtag go for champ gets free pussy. Oh. <laughs> Yo, I'm trying to just freestyle you. Yo, get my charge. I'm at three. <laughs> You're at 3%? I guess that means I get the last Yo, word. Yo, you use my shit. I'm going to slam your ass to a table. <laughs> Alright, guys. Like I said, vote underneath. Like, comment, subscribe. You know the deal. And remember, you heard it first from Harley. You mad? Yo, shut your little dumbass up, you prick looking motherfucker, pink blaring motherfucker, looking like a gay homosexual like shit. You ain't even buff, nigga. You can't even pick me the fuck up. I only weigh 140, nigga. 
You ain't gonna do shit. You can't win shit. I'm gonna walk in there, take the fucking title, beat your ass with it, shove it up your ass like shit. I don't give a fuck because I'm retaining it. I'll wash it. I'll hit your bitch. I'll fuck your bitch. I'll put a baby in your bitch. The walkout champion.